Tim, I want to ask you, man, like, you played in some, like, some golden eras of basketball, bro. Like, and, um, you know, obviously, our teams <laughs> were coming up against those Spurs teams, so we developed a little distaste in the mouth, if you will, for the Spurs. Um, <laughs> politely, let me ask you, though, who, like, who was it for you guys, man? Like, who, was, the, was there a team that just was, like, given the opportunity, like, we'd like to beat them down. Like, it was more than just we want to win the game. Like, were there were there guys like that for you, bro? Where the Phoenix like, Suns with Raja Bell personal. on the team. Yeah. The Absolutely. Phoenix Suns with Raja Bell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, at, at, at one point it absolutely was. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was early on. It was Utah. Um, Utah was a hump we had to get over. There with the uh, uh, they were dominant early on, and especially in Mike early, we had to get over that hump. Um, then it was uh, the Lakers, and it was Phoenix. Um, it was Dallas. So Dallas and Houston, obviously, um, right down the road, were always good rivals uh, and had had uh, had good teams. So it kind of flux throughout my career but uh, probably those and then obviously with the teams with uh, uh with any team kg was on was always a a, a big uh, a big game let me hey, hey, don't, listen to kg K- kg used to like he had more antics dog tim i don't know like maybe because you guys were about the same size like he didn't do that shit to you i don't know but like he talked the most shit and like i remember one time he hit me with like a bow like to see what I was going to do. Like, you know what I mean? Just trying to kind of like punk you a little bit. And so yeah. the next time I came down, I fired one right in his ribs and he looked at me like, he left me alone after that. But well, like, after that, what, yeah. that's who he is, right? <laughs> like, that's what he tried to do. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah he, he's, he's done that a lot. He'll test you early, figure out who you are. Right. Uh, and yeah, okay, depending okay. on your, re- your response, yeah, you, you, get, you get a certain type of response from him later on. But yeah, right. exactly that. <laughs> Yeah, those those individuals who, who who came down and fired back um, at some point, you, 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 they'll uh, he usually left them alone, give them a little more leeway. Right. He That's said funny. that you. He said that you. It would frustrate him the most that he would talk all his shit, but she would smile and say like "good job" and stuff. Like that would piss him off the most. <laughs> Why would you never engage in trash talk, Tim? Uh, with him, because that's what he wanted. Okay. That's what he wanted. He want he wanted to, to to get you outside of yourself. He wanted to to to, to piss you off and kind of control the situation. And I, I guess I recognize that. And plus, it wasn't part of my game. Like uh, it, it would it would it frustrates people um, more when you just keep coming and coming and coming and you just keep getting things done. And no matter what they throw at you or no matter what they do, it just it just um, it, it it doesn't affect you and it kind of. It, it ends up affecting them uh, much more than it does you. So that, that was my way. Uh, that was my, uh, uh, what I figured out to be most effective. And uh, it, it fit with my game. Like I didn't, yeah. I didn't have to trash talk. I didn't need to trash talk. I wasn't, I wasn't good at it. So um, I was just about to ask you <laughs> if you yeah. were even good at doing it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So it was my, my more thing was just like kind of poke there, just kind of, kind of poke him a little bit and Bro. piss him off a little bit. And then, they react and poke him again. First of all, I talk no shit either because I'd have been like the dude to be like, you too. Like, I was just going to be bad at that. Like, was, I wasn't going to be any good at that. So I couldn't do that. But he, Timmy doesn't remember this shit. We were, we were like, I was across from our bench in San Antonio, like swing, swing to the corner. Tim's on a late closeout, right? So I'm like, this shit is cash. So I pull up, like I'm stroking it. And I said something like, yeah, that shit's in the bucket. And it like rattled out. And this mofo like tapped me and said, hey, Rod, don't, don't count it before it goes in. And it keeps going down the other way. And I'm like, you mother, no, no. <laughs> <laughs>